my only memory is the burning of flesh. I remember it so vividly. Regret and hatred are all I am made of now. Yet, I can remember. Love. Wonder. A love that haunts me. A love that no longer exists. A love that was taken from me by the Prince of Hell. Mount Volga! I made a deal. I sealed my fate all for the love of my wife. Forced by all things evil to join with two miserable companions of misfortune. See the beam that just struck Central Park? I saw it. What was it? Surely a herald of things to come. I'm not exactly sure what it was, but it can't be good. A herald of things to come? What are you saying? I have a feeling that you're about to get involved in something that may overwhelm you. Whatever that beam was, I can handle it. Now, if you don't have anything helpful to say... The presence I felt, it's close. I don't know. It seems familiar. What the hell are you up to, Violator? I thought I'd warn you to keep away from my city. Things change, Bonnie. Our master will have need of his general before long. Be my guest. I want nothing to do with him anyway. Damn you, Spawn. You've pissed me off one too many times. Prepare for oblivion. <laughs> Honey, how could you? It was easy. You're my bitch. <laughs> You're making jokes now. Okay, Violator. You know something I don't, and I don't like that. Tell me what's going on here. <laughs> oh, poor Spawny. Always in the dark. Well, things are going to be brightening up around here soon. They need a new weapon, Spawny. Those crazy people who think they run this place. The hellhole is open, and all hell is going to break loose. Jason went up to this time. All right, Jason. What are you hiding? Mm -hmm. There's nothing in here about a weapon with a beam like the one I saw. But what's this? Cybernetic soldier experiment. Performance enhancers. Test subject escaped. Heading for the city. Uh, now this is more my style. Heavy weapon shipments arriving at the dock tonight. First good news I've had all day. Hmm. Heavy security defenses. And here's the blueprint. What took you so long? I've been expecting you for quite some time. Did 
Jason Wynn's guards give you trouble? No trouble. I've been on the scenic tour of the city. Well, I'm glad to see you're concerned about this beam and what it could mean. You're worried about that? I have more immediate problems. Really? Such as? Such as this. You can look after yourself after all. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Okay, Mimon. What's going on? The city streets are teeming with demons. I've been attacked by angels, and robotic monsters are invading my alley. I need answers. Some of these events are unexpected. I'm as much in the dark as you are. A beam shot down from high in the sky. Wynn has nothing about it in his files. I wonder... Wonder what? This is getting bigger and bigger by the moment. Come with me. We have some people that we need to talk to. Some people we need to talk to? What other information can people provide to us? Enough! You! You set me up! Be quiet, Spock. I did no such thing. Though I did want the two of you to meet. How did you know I wanted you here? You wanted me here. I was just tracking him so I could kill him. Calm down. If we work together, we might find a solution that benefits us all. We're collaborating with angels now? Angels are involved with all of this. All right, I've had enough. You two can bicker among yourselves. I'm going to find my answers my own way. Spawn, stop. Come back here. Turn to Angel Station with me. If you fight me, you will lose. He's healed himself. This isn't good. Spawn! Mamon, leave me alone. I've got business to take care of. You can't beat him here. You must go where he can't follow. You can mean... Yes, Spawn. Enter the hellhole. Piece by piece. 
The more demons you send up there, the more they will capture and use to power their weapon. You cannot defeat them. I am your only chance. Return me to the surface and I will destroy the angel weapon. Without it, the angels will be far too weak for you. So you are offering to lead my armies. By your hand you will deliver heaven and earth to me. Only if you promise to set me free, so that I may pick my own side in the final battle. Not <laughs> without you, I would need another general. It is done. The hellhole is closed. Now it's time for Malbosia to fulfill his side of the bargain. I'm afraid that won't be happening, my friend. What? You were promised your humanity if the weapon was never fired again. But, indeed, it was. Shit. 